Hello and welcome to the Southeast Idaho Weather Hazard Briefing for Thursday, October 31st. Happy Halloween. Start here with a surface weather depiction. This is really the only day where we even have any slight chance and it barely gets to that level of precipitation. You can see in the extreme northeast corner of eastern Idaho in the Island Park and Max Inn area there is a slight chance today of snow is what the white shading indicates as uh, this moisture that we had uh, over the past couple of days continues to move eastward and the ridge of high pressure builds in stronger um, and hopefully we'll eventually get out of this northerly airflow that has created this record cold um, a number of locations got below zero and they never have ever before uh, gotten to below zero in the month of October. So we'll start here. You can see the area of a slight chance again just up there on the Montana uh, Idaho border uh, up there you know from Max Inn and, and uh, Island Park areas northward. Uh, these are the highs today not very warm. Uh, we'll struggle to get above freezing once again in Pocatello. Uh, Idaho Falls will hopefully get above freezing today, uh, but you can see how that northerly air flow has just uh, is going to keep things cold, especially on our border with Montana. And overnight lows, uh, not quite as bad as they have been, uh, a little bit warmer. Uh, with even um, Stanley staying above zero at plus five. And again, here on Friday during the day, there's just a slight chance up there near the border once again. And as you can see here, we are starting to warm up. I actually see some 40 degree temperatures in the Snake River Plain. And even uh, Stanley under sunny skies uh, will compete to be the warmest spot uh, in eastern and central Idaho. And overnight lows here on uh, Friday night uh, getting to see and they are starting to moderate but these are still well below normal for this time of year. And here are the highs on Saturday. Again we're struggling to this is still below normal for all locations. Normal in Pocatello for this time of year would be 50 degrees see the forecast high is only 46. And overnight lows, uh, we are going to cloud up a little bit uh, Saturday night. And you can see it does help with the temperatures, keeping them warmer. Uh, Pocatello actually staying above 20 degrees. Here's the extended forecast. Uh, just looking for a slight chance of rain and snow on the Wyoming border from Driggs northward on Monday. But otherwise, uh, just clouds rolling in and out, temperatures staying, uh, getting a little bit warmer than they've been, uh, getting more towards normal. You can see the Snicker Plane getting into the 50s once again, at least in some of the locations. And then uh, things cooling down for Wednesday. And you can pause this uh, to look at details. That's all I have. If you have any further questions, you can always contact us 24 hours a day, 7 days a week at that telephone number. Or you can check out the weather yourself at weather.gov slash Pocatello. If you have any comments on the content or, the f or any feedback for this briefing, email our webmaster at this address. Thanks for watching.